get you a drink or anything. No, I'm fine, thanks. Still want to sink in. I know. I'm the same. Well, it's no wonder you're both in shock. I've been thinking, I, um... I wanted to ask you something. I'll always remember you, Rana. Sweet dreams. Doesn't get any easier, does it? <laughs> I can't do this. I can't do it. No, not now. Imran, please. Whoever's taken Rana, I need to know. You couldn't care less when she was alive. Why are you pretending to care now that she's dead? Whatever you think of me, I'm still her mother. You disowned her. Hey, Rana, I loved her so much. No, no, no. No, you loved her when she told the line. When she did as she was told. When she played the dutiful daughter. And the minute she goes off on her own, you bit her off. Right, Rana, we hate us fighting. We all need to sit down together. Talk. There's nothing to talk about. Save your tears. It's too little, too late. I didn't know whether to come or not. I didn't want to intrude. I've already told you, you're very welcome. I'm so sorry for your loss. I know what it's like to lose a child. I understand you were with her when she took her last breath. Was she in pain? The paramedics were there, they'd given her something. Did she say anything? We said our vows. I know you still don't approve of me. But we're in the same boat now, you and me. We both love Brown and we both lost her. Please don't. Don't compare the love I have for her, her mother's love, with what you had. Come on, come on now. You don't have to be enemies. I haven't got the strength to be anyone's enemy. She was so pleased when you gave her that bracelet. You meant the world to her. <laughs> Imran said you would come round to that of us getting married. You just needed a little time. We even talked about postponing the wedding. I wish you had postponed and then none of this would have happened. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think I should go. 